Before I made a video on the best way to get aluminum, which is taking a little while to thoroughly research, I wanted to address the new tools and materials introduced in the latest update. Last Day on Earth introduced two tools, the iron hatchet and the iron pickaxe, and while they look amazing, I would argue that they're a waste of your resources. A normal hatchet requires three wood and three stone and is good for 50 hits, which amounts to around 37 pieces of wood. The iron hatchet requires two planks, three iron, and a piece of blue tape, which has become a pretty rare and valuable item. In exchange, the iron hatchet is good for 75 hits, which amounts to around 56 pieces of wood. The iron tools do not collect materials faster, and as far as I know, the iron pickaxe does not increase your chances of getting bauxite, though I haven't done enough research to be sure of this yet. The only reason to build the iron hatchet is to break through the level 2 walls of your three neighbors, which if you haven't done that yet, you need to stop everything and go do that. You will get guns, aluminum, tons of blue tape, and a bunch of really awesome items. Make sure to go completely naked so that you only have to take two trips. Seriously, all you should bring is a backpack, four normal hatchets, and two iron hatchets for your two neighbors on the left and middle, and three normal hatchets and one iron hatchet for your neighbor near Bunker Alpha. You should also bring four empty bottles to the neighbor on the left so that you can drain his motorcycle's gas tank. Okay, let's move to charcoal. For those of you who didn't already know this, each piece of wood provides two minutes of fuel for your campfires and furnaces, while planks provide three minutes of fuel, making it 50% more efficient to use planks. Charcoal is a little more complicated. A piece of charcoal provides fuel for six minutes, but it requires four minutes of fuel to make it. So if you just use the three pieces of wood required to make one piece of charcoal, then you are literally wasting your time. However, if you use planks as the resource, which turns into two charcoal, and charcoal as the fuel, then you will be able to stretch each piece of wood you collect into a net gain of eight minutes worth of fuel.